Uh, but I never got to see John play, uh, and I wish I had. You know, uh, for uh, even you know, even though I didn't meet him, I can I can tell you there's a lot of lessons to learn simply from his character and, and his career. Uh, when folks when folks come at me and say, um, you know, we hear a little John Prine in your voice, to me that's an enormous compliment because his legacy about his legacy and his gift of songwriting is one of the best things uh, about the national music industry, I think, and, and we've all accepted that. You know, he's one of the masters of all time right? um, at turning a phrase and injecting humor into his work, but also being able to make people feel. Uh, I think that when, when folks come up and say, hey man, we hear John Prine in your voice, um, not only is it a compliment, but uh, it's also a reminder that like, I mean, there's a guy that uh, was one of the best poets of his time, but yeah, it took him probably 40 years to get going, you know? <laughs> Um, and sometimes commercial success uh, is not the definition of, of your own success. Right? Um, and so I believe that his stories and um, the, the, the people's hearts and souls that he spoke to, that, that, was, that was his winning success. You know?